On April 30th, around 11.50 p.m., a Las Vegas Metro Police officer's body camera video recorded something unusual across the sky. In fact, he wasn't the only person to see a bright light streaking low. Several people across eastern California, Nevada, and Utah reported seeing the flash. What was the strange light and where did it disappear? The answer came 40 minutes later when a man called 911 and reported that something fell from the sky into his backyard and they saw two strange beings appear from within the crashed object. Did a UFO crash in a house in Las Vegas? And did the family really witness alien beings in their backyard? It's time to solve the biggest UFO encounter mystery of 2023. UFO and alien encounters are not new. In fact, it's a phenomenon we have been debating for decades now. Several people have claimed to have spotted strange flying objects in the sky. Some have reported seeing crash sites, while some have taken these sightings one step further with the claims of witnessing alien beings. Interestingly, governments across the globe dismiss these sightings, blaming the viewers for either hallucinating everything or over-imagining it. Not once has a report been confirmed. Does that mean all those who have come forward with these claims are liars or attention seekers? Or does it indicate a bigger game at play where governments dismiss alien existence to cover up their own involvement with alien technology? While this debate can go on forever, we have one alien encounter in 2023 that sent shockwaves through Las Vegas. It all began when a Las Vegas Metropolitan Police Department officer recorded a suspected UFO cruising the night sky. Fortunately, he wasn't the only one to observe this bizarre light in the night sky, or this sighting would have also been dismissed as a hallucination. According to the American Meteor Society, the object's light was so bright that it was reportedly noticed as far as California. Around 40 minutes after the police officer noticed this streaking light, a resident near Area 51 made a chilling call to 911. He described an object crashing into his backyard and two unknown entities emerging. Interestingly, the man who made the 911 call wasn't alone at home, which meant there were more than one eyewitnesses to this incident. The man described the alien beings in his backyard to be unusually tall, around eight feet. The resident also claimed that these beings had large eyes and a big mouth. Looking at them and sensing their presence, the eyewitness was absolutely sure that they were not human. Apart from the chilling account, the 911 responder could sense that the man was petrified. He also insisted that it was not a joke, and he really feared for his life. The responding officers visited the man's house shortly after the 911 call. Surprisingly, they felt a little hesitant and anxious because one of them had actually seen a shooting star and now had to contend with reports of aliens in someone's backyard. To make matters worse, another police officer corroborated the witness's account, claiming that their partner had also observed something falling from the sky. This UFO sighting had all the ingredients for a bizarre extraterrestrial recipe, much like other cases that keep popping up around the globe, an alleged spaceship crash, strange beings, and other bits and pieces that don't make much sense. Luckily, this incident caught the police department's attention since multiple officers had witnessed the bizarre object. In fact, one of them even had it on tape thanks to the footage from his body cam. According to one report, when an officer caught a glimpse of the colorful object on his body cam, at almost the same time, a ring camera in the vicinity recorded a loud crashing sound. The man who made the 911 call was working with his brother on a vehicle in the backyard of their home. The two witnessed the glowing object hurtling through the sky, finally crashing in front of them. When the flying object hit the ground, the two brothers felt a shockwave passing through their bodies, and while the object had landed right before them, they did not have a clear view. According to one of them, it looked as if an unknown form of camouflage obscured the thing. They were obviously in a state of utter shock, and that's what prompted the 911 call. Right after this encounter, the family who witnessed it all was very vocal about their experience. They spoke to the media on several occasions and described what they saw. For example, one eyewitness, Angel, said he heard multiple footsteps on their roof. He even saw one of the creatures climb behind the controls of a large front loader stored in the yard. According to Angel's account, 
One of the creatures had grayish-green skin, if you can even call it skin. He said that he could actually hear its deep breaths, and there came a time when he locked eyes with it. In that one moment, he felt frozen in place, unable to move or speak. After a few intense minutes, the beings vanished along with the object that had crashed in a Las Vegas backyard. The only thing left behind was a circular impression on the ground and some shaken family members. When the first responders got to the scene, they were pretty nervous themselves. They asked the family what they had seen that night and returned to their station once they were sure everyone in the house was safe and calm. Two Metro sergeants did a follow-up a few days later, and the family also reported men in sweats and sunglasses with government platy cars doing rounds of their home. You must be wondering why there's no video evidence of this incitement. The house may have had a surveillance camera that caught this bizarre scene unfolding. Maybe one of the family members captured this extraordinary scene on their phone. There could be several possibilities. But the truth remains that we don't have any evidence other than eyewitness accounts to validate the sighting report. But this is where the story gets interesting. There was a surveillance camera in the backyard. The owner of the house had some expensive equipment stored there, and therefore he installed a camera to keep an eye on it. But the bad news is the camera didn't record anything because exactly when the object came down towards the ground, the camera went out. Some might think it's a convenient lie to cover up a make-believe story, but it's possible that the aliens aboard the UFO used their advanced technological powers to turn off the surveillance camera. That would also explain why there is no video footage of these alleged aliens from anywhere around the world. Of course, there is always a possibility that such footage does exist, but it's never revealed to the public. Interestingly, one of the eyewitnesses, Angel, claimed over multiple phone calls with a leading news channel that he had shot videos of the creatures. However, he failed to produce even one of them. Why do you think the family suddenly became silent and refused to talk to the media? Were they instructed to stay quiet? Metro Police's investigation turned up no concrete answers. And while the case remained open for several days, the department eventually closed it due to a lack of substantial evidence. Representatives from nearby Creech and Nellis Air Force bases denied involvement in the incident, and the spokesperson for the Pentagon also refused to answer questions regarding the sighting. Can you see the recurring pattern in UFO and alien sightings? Witnesses report incidents that they have seen with their own eyes. The police either thinks of it as a joke, and in the rare instances where they do investigate, they find nothing. The U.S. Air Force either tells the media that the eyewitness saw one of their own jets or its reflection. At other times, they take the high road, refusing even to acknowledge the sighting. In all these cases, the eyewitnesses are ridiculed and turned into a laughingstock. And just as suddenly as they become a media sensation, they disappear from the limelight altogether. Do you agree with this assessment? Let us know your thoughts on the Las Vegas alien encounter. Is it real or a hoax? Remember to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel with the notifications on for more thrilling UFO and alien encounter stories.